All right, good day to everybody. So today I'm gonna show you how to turn a plain old canvas into a piece of work like this here. So this is the first video I've done in a long time. It's been a few, actually almost about a year. So I decided to start making tutorials on how to show you some of my artwork and how to do it. So if you're thinking about going professional, trying to get some work started, I do have some artwork in my gallery. So I would advise you to go and start looking around for people who kind of look for talent like yours. So one thing about art is you gotta learn to accept criticism. So as you can see, I got a bit of everything here. I do a bit of all, but you have to learn to take criticism because without criticism, you will never grow. And just remember, people aren't out there to degrade you. They're out there to actually help you grow. So let's go ahead and get started. So the first thing I got is step one. So step one, you might want to come up with a sketch such as this one here. I mean, it's just a, uh, an idea. You don't have to go with that, but you want to come up with your sketch. You want to have an idea of what you're doing. So what is your vision? Are you trying to make a space painting, a, uh, I don't know, a murder scene? What are you trying to come up with? You have to make sure you have it written out first. You want to sketch that in. Second, you need a nice little canvas like this. It could be any canvas. You can get them at Michael's for, I don't know, five for $20, very cheap. So the first thing you want to do is you want to take your sketch and you want to go ahead and copy it into your canvas. So I'm going to do the dinosaur for the heck of it. I, though I really didn't officially want to do this. Not this dinosaur, of course, but I'm going to go ahead and start and all you have to do is, well, let's adjust the view a little bit. All right, okay. So first you wanna start sketching your portrait. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with mine. So I usually like starting from the far right corner, but I'm gonna start from the left today. So copying our dinosaur, we're gonna make a little spinosaurus here so you gotta start by sketching it don't be afraid to make mistakes it happens it's an artist thinks you will make mistakes but the good thing is you either can make something better out of those mistakes you can use them for you or they will work against you that's just how it works that's the artist's life so as you can see I got my little spinosaurus here doesn't look as good as the one on the, on the sketch, but the good thing is you can always go back and fix it. There's no problem with that. So there it goes. Now let's go ahead and get this little eye here. There it goes. All right. So then now we're going to do his arm here. And remember Spinosaurus has a lengthy arm more lengthy than T-Rex and other Cretaceous creatures. So, there it goes. I got his claws down, boom. Now I've got a Spinosaurus. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this. I'm gonna go ahead and sketch the rest of the picture. And I'll see you in a few minutes for part two. 